hope she has uh, a life with God now and that he's got a, a big job waiting for her somewhere. And it'll make everybody else happy. Friends say Wendy Harris Aceves could light up a room. She was killed Sunday night in a deadly crash in Boca Raton. Now, police say a 15 year old in a stolen car crashed into her SUV. News Channel 5's Charlie Keegan hears from people who called her a true friend. This is Wendy here. Donna Henderson doesn't want to believe it. She was so happy, uh, jovial. She describes her friend Wendy Harris to me as the first volunteer, whether it was at church. She always helped all the children. Or at scouts. Now her friend. Always got a smile for everyone. Is gone too soon. Wendy was killed Sunday when a teen driving a stolen car crashed into her near West Palmetto Park Road and 2nd Avenue. Wendy leaves behind two kids and an extended church family. We're all kind of still very numb. Hugo Nunez is focusing on the good memories. He met Wendy through the parish school and scouts. Yeah, he started as a Tiger Scout. Hugo and Donna turned to their faith to try to understand why someone so dedicated was taken before her work was done. He has a plan. We don't know exactly how it all works out or why, but, but that's just the way, you know, that it is. For a woman described as so selfless, even in death, her friends tell me she wouldn't want anyone to be angry but instead find compassion for everyone involved. In Boca Raton, Charlie Keegan, WPTV News Channel 5. The 15-year-old who police say caused the crash was moved from the hospital to a secure detention center today. Prosecutors have 21 days to decide whether to charge him as an adult. Meanwhile, the funeral for Wendy is set for Saturday.